selecting cases and splitting the data set. In this session you will learn how to select only certain cases for analysis and how to split your data set into groups. First, selecting only certain cases for analysis. Sometimes you want to run statistical procedures for only part of your data set. Let's assume your data set consists of men and women, but for now you are only interested in information about the women. For instance, you want to know the mean age of the women rather than the mean age of the entire data set taken together. In this case, before you run the means procedure, you select all female respondents but exclude the male respondents. You can do this with the Select Cases function. Go to Data, Select Cases, if condition is satisfied. Click the If button. A new window pops up and you enter your condition, namely sex equals 1. Remember that we coded sex as 1 for females and as 2 for males. So if you select only those respondents who have a 1 for sex, you get all the women, but not the men. Click Continue. You're now back to the previous window. Take another look at the If button. It says, select cases if sex equals 1. Now go further down, where it says, unselected cases are filtered. Always leave that option as it is. If you choose the delete option instead, all the excluded respondents will be deleted from the dataset. It is usually a bad idea to delete cases because you lose information, so never select that option. Click OK. You're now back to the dataset and crosshatches mark the seven cases that have been excluded. And to the right, a filter variable has been added. Let's now compute the mean age for our subset. Go to Analyze, Descriptive Statistics, Descriptives, select Age, and then go to the Options button because we are interested only in the mean, not the other default functions. Click OK. And the mean age for our female subset is 26.4. Let's now go back to the dataset and compute the mean age for all cases, just for fun. To do that, you have to remove the filter. Go to Data, select Cases, and then you can select All Cases. We're going to cancel out for that because an alternative option you have is by just deleting the filter variable. As you can see, the crosshatches are gone and we can now compute the mean age for our respondents. The mean age for our respondents is 29.92 years. Now I show you how to split the data set. Sometimes you want to include every single respondent in the analysis, but you're interested in how different groups within the data set compare with one another. Let's assume you want to know the different religious groups and how they compare with respect to age. Is the mean age for the Catholics lower than that of the Protestants and of those who belong to another religion? For this, you would split the data set. Go to Data, Split File. Click Compare Groups. Since you want to compare the different religions, you send the variable religion into the box. Then click OK. Note that in the lower right hand corner a notification has appeared. Split file is on. This tells you that whatever you do from now on will be done separately for the three religious groups. Let's now compare the three groups with respect to age. You can see that the Catholics are the oldest, with mean age 32.75. The Protestants, with 23 years, are the youngest.
Let's go back to the data. To return to examining all respondents together, rather than in groups, you have to turn off the split. Do this by going to Data, Split File. Select Analyze All Cases and click OK. Notice that the warning Split File is on has disappeared.